Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. Before I begin, I would like to say thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, and who has donated to this channel. Um, also, thank you to everyone who has purchased a reading with me. This is for the sign of Scorpio for the month of April, uh, or from the time you view this video, these events could be in play. Please keep in mind it is a general reading. That means it will not resonate with each and every one of you who are watching. If these first few cards here, um, if, that, if it doesn't sound like your story, then most likely the message is not for you. So let's begin. Um, what they're showing you can be indecisiveness. You, um, I, honestly, what I feel... Um, you're not with this person. Um, I It could have been an on-again, off-again type of relationship with that Knight of Swords. And every time, um, you know, the person rides in, um, rides out, a lot of damage is left. And this is why this indecisiveness is here with regards to... Um, a commitment or the offer of one, uh, not really knowing what to do. Um, so I feel like this person is actually um, not really showing you much, except probably there may not have been communication. Um, but they're there because they're watching. Page of Swords reverse. Somebody who does things behind the scenes and that's what they're doing. Um, what are they thinking? They're thinking back over the journey. Um, they have a wish and they've had this wish before. Um... They're fishing for information. It's here. Um, again, this can be the World Wide Web. So this can be internet. They could be watching you over the net. If they live in close proximity, or they were just watching you from behind the scenes. Um, they could be thinking that, you know, maybe they're just fantasizing. Maybe it's not really their sword to pull. Maybe they would be putting effort for nothing. Uh, the wish has been denied to them in the past, so maybe it's not the right path. This person has not healed. from, you know, whatever caused that breakup there. There could have been challenging words spoken in the past here, uh, hurtful words that have not been forgotten. I feel like they, they, may, they may think of sending a message. They just don't know they don't know how to fix things. Um, they have not cut you out. The guard, uh, the the sword rests against the chair. So they may have planned, or yeah, they may have planned or be planning to send off this message, but it has not left the ground yet. And it's like um, they go over it in their mind. Wanting to reach for this opportunity, wishing for it here, but fear of being turned down. The sun in this deck, the sun has not um, 
has not fully risen. Um, everything still sleeps on this card. Uh, so little clarity. They're they're lacking clarity um, for something that at one time did have a lot of hope and optimism for this person. Um, they may feel that you might suspect uh, or be suspicious of this offer and turn it down. Very possible. Because the snake is delivering the coin. And so that, that's why there's very little hope. Or they are suspicious of your offer. So what they're planning is um, to send off a message. But it has not left. They have not done it. Um, you get the sense that they almost feel defeated with the arms, the way they hang over the head here on this hangman. What is influencing their behavior is this Pied Piper card. Um, this is the card of the trickster and the seducer. Um, this is um, somebody who knows exactly what to say to get what they want. The page of rods in reverse, um, there's been no news. So for just for that reason alone, they would be guarded. Um, and they're assessing this commitment or potential. For some of you, um, the person you uh, are dealing with could already be in a commitment because of the this card here. So I feel like this person, they've been doing a lot of reflecting and, and we see that in these other cards uh, up here, this, uh, this nine of coins, uh, the wish, uh, she's, you can see she's sitting on this wishing well and the, the older wishers, wishes are just floating there. And the hanged man over here who looks completely defeated, doesn't really know what exactly to do to get the desired result, which is the wish, ultimately. Here we see all the swords. One hangs directly over the heart, so clearly this person has suffered some deep heartache because the three of swords came before this and put them there. Now, here in the outcome, it is in the reverse, so it's like coming out of isolation, but I feel like it's more like a wanting to because the six of swords in reverse is being unable, unable to move something from negative to positive. Eight of Cups. This person walks away not because they want to, but because they feel it no longer emotionally serves them. But here we have this Ten of Rods wanting to lay these burdens down. Here we have this person crouched down in fear and this King of Cups in reverse, who is keeping uh, his feelings hidden, I feel. So 
so I feel like it's almost like you get this this energy of this hangman who just doesn't know what to do and just feels like walking away from it all but I feel like they're unable to and they keep all these feelings to themselves this is somebody who may have been um, rejected by you and it's like they cannot lay these burdens down they cannot come out of this three of swords uh, energy as much as they want to and as much as they've tried so this could be like an energy because they they may feel like um, you know uh, that you might be tricking them um, or that you're going to turn them down again um, they, they carry a lot of emotional baggage so now this message hasn't left yet and it's possible that they're even rethinking this because they're feeling so down because when I was dealing out these cards laying them out right when I got here it's like this really heavy energy sits here and you can really feel it in the heart area so I think that for now this person is not moving on this right now as much as they want to and desire reaching for it they don't know how and um, they're not trusting the situation they're very guarded still because you know this is like okay I've been hurt before and it's like you know I don't really <laughs> I don't want to be hurt again so I'm like keeping this sword over my heart it's like maybe they're just unable to let love back in at this time but they are watching that is what I have for you I thank you for watching and many blessings bye for now